ಮೊದಲ ನಾಟರಾಗ ಕಾಂಪೋಸಿಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಮುತ್ತುಸ್ವಾಮಿ ದೀಕ್ಷಿತ ಮ್ಯಾಂಡರಿನ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಏಟ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರೆಂಗ್ಸ
You've taken up a Western instrument. How did you adapt it to the Carnatic style of music? I have not uh, changed anything in the instrument. I have reduced the strings from eight strings to five strings. That is the only modification of the instrument. Cut. Five strings. You've taken up a Western instrument. How did you adapt it to Carnatic style of music? Actually, there is. Uh, I have not changed any thing in the instrument. Actually, mandolin got originally eight strings, four pairs of strings. I used to play with four strings, that is single strings. Now, uh, again, I started to play with five strings. That the fifth string is very the bass string, which is more uh, important for uh, South Indian classical music. Now only now I'm playing with five strings. That is the only uh, modification of the instrument. Now. That's what I made it. For them? Nah. Mm -hmm. uh, what about this? Play the same thing. Same thing. Ah. Okay. What do you think this time is for close ups and all? Yes, same thing. You'll have to come this way. Come. No, you have to go back. Your shirt is still seen. <laughs> Ready? Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to teach you in the composition of. Mutusam Dikshitar in the Ragam Nata set to Aditam.
Not only you can look up also direct, you know, both man. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Once, just once. Right. Yeah. You can lift your face one bit. Yeah, please. <laughs> Srinivas, you've been uh, performing since a very young age. Uh, obviously, it must have meant uh, tra a lot of traveling, uh, which would have meant giving up on a lot of things which uh, a normal youngster goes through. Uh, you think you had to give up a lot of things for the sake of music? I never think that I'm missing a lot of things because I'm doing my BA, privately and correspondent course. I never, um, uh, I studied up to fourth class. After that, I have been doing everything by private. So I never uh, missed anything at all. Uh, but what about uh, going out and playing on the street with your friends and uh, going out otherwise normally, which most students or kids I'm, do? I am not uh, interested in uh, going out and uh, playing games since my age of uh, six. Just I'm always uh, interested in playing, always interested in pla practicing day by day. And uh, I have always uh, in my mind to practice uh, and uh, to learn new and everything. That's all. Right.
Srinivas, how did you get interested in this particular instrument? When I was exactly six years old, my father gave me this instrument and uh, he found a talent in me, immediately taught me on the mandolin. And uh, I was also very interested in this instrument to learn. Uh, what do you like about this instrument? Uh, I was impressed by, impressed by this uh, sound and also the size when I was six years old. Uh, who's been your inspiration? My father uh, is main inspiration behind me. First is my guru, then is he taught me on the mandolin. Later on, I learned from Sri Subbaraju. He is a vocal musician and also disciple of the great Chambai Vajanada Bhagavatar. Okay? My brother also plays mandolin. His name is Rajesh. Now, I, my, myself and my brother will play one song.
Okay. Uh, Rajesh, how do you find your brother as a teacher? He's a good teacher. He teaches softly. Uh, does he ever scold you or...? No, he won't scold me at all. Why? Just because he's your brother or...? Uh... No, really, he won't scold me. Hey, does he scold...? He teaches to all the same. Equally he teaches. He won't show any partiality to, to anyone.
ഏയ് കുട്ടി ഹലോ നമസ്തേ സാർ സൗഖ്യമാ ഇരിക്കുന്നില്ല സൗഖ്യമാ ഇരിക്കാൻ എപ്പോൾ ജൂണാ ഫ്രം ഫിഫ്റ്റീൻത്ത് ടു ട്വൻറ്റി എയ്ത്ത് ഐ വോണ്ട് ബി ഫ്രീ ഇൻ ദി ജൂലൈ ഇല്ലേ സാർ ഇൻ ദി ജൂൽ ഇൻ ജൂലൈ ഐ എം ഗോയിങ് ടു എബ്രോഡ് സോ ഐ ഐ ഐ വിൽ നോട്ട് ബി ഫ്രീ ഇൻ ജൂ ഇൻ ദി മന്ത് ഓഫ് ജൂലൈ so if you are interested to arrange my program on uh, 15th of june you can you can arrange no problem okay let me know within 2 days okay thank you sir namaskaram so okay after that you keep on calling i'll ask you a question don't look at me you keep looking at the phone then i ask you then you look at me hello നമസ്തേ സാർ ഹവ് ആർ യു സാർ ഐ എം ഫൈൻ സാർ വൻ എപ്പോൾ ഫിഫ്റ്റീൻത്താ ഫിഫ്റ്റീൻത്ത് ഓക്കെ ഫിഫ്റ്റീൻത്ത് ഓക്കെ ഐ തിങ്ക് ഐ ഐ ബി ഫ്രീ ഇൻ ദി ജോലൈ നോ സാർ ഇൻ ദി ജോലൈ ഐ ബി ഗോ ടു മലേഷ്യ യെസ് സാർ ഫിഫ്റ്റീൻത്ത് വിൽ ബി ഓക്കെ രണ്ട് നാല് കൂടെ കൺഫേം പണ്ടല്ല ഓക്കെ സർ നമസ്തേ ശ്രീനിവാസ് യു കേം ഇൻ ടു ലൈം ലൈഫ് വെൻ യു വർ ട്വൽവ് ഇയേഴ്സ് ഓൾഡ് ആസ് എ ചൈൽഡ് പ്രോഡിജി ടുഡേ യു ആർ എൻ എ കംപ്ലീഷ്ഡ് ആർട്ടിസ്റ്റ് എറ്റ് ട്വൻറ്റി ടു ഐ എം ഷുവർ ദ ടെൻ ഇയേഴ്സ് ഇൻ ബിറ്റ്വീൻ മസ്റ്റ് ഹിൻ വെരി ടഫ് ടെൽ എസ് സംതിങ് അബൌട്ട് പ്ലീസ് മൈ എക്സ്പീരിയൻസ് യാ ദർ ആർ സോ മെനി അൺഫർഗറ്റബിൾ തിങ്സ് so many unforgettable incidents to tell uh, within my 10 years experience i can't uh, forget each incident where uh, wherever and uh, wherever i go either in india or abroad i am getting very good response from the audience so if 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 i see the good atmosphere from the audience so i i will get a very good mood and um, i never expected any uh, i never expected that uh, i become Uh, one of the good musician i believe in god by god's grace day by day i'm going up and i pray god to give me uh, a good no- uh, knowledge in music to improve every time uh, but you must have put in a lot of effort besides having faith in god uh, how many hours did you practice every day i practice every day 3 to 4 hours if i am in madras i will practice 5 to 6 hours if i go outside of madras i will practice 3 uh, to 4 hours daily i have to practice otherwise uh, i can't touch the instrument cut Uh, you came into limelight at the age of 12 and you were hailed as a child prodigy do uh, you i'm sure you got a lot of uh, media publicity and a lot of people talked about you did it uh, affect your performance in any way at that time it was uh, it was giving me very good encouraging encouragement to me when people say good i will get uh, more encouragement and uh, i will try to improve my knowledge by each concert unless uh, very good uh, encouragement from from the public 
we can't uh, improve our uh, music okay cut we'll take it once again Srinivas, you are hailed as a child prodigy at the age of 12. A lot of uh, media publicity was given to you. A lot of people talked about you. Uh, did it in any way affect your performance? Or were there any kind of pressures on you because of this publicity? Uh, it has not affected me. It has given me, uh, actually it has given me very... good exp- very good uh, encouragement when i get a good uh, report from the public i i feel very happy and try to improve each concert uh, each concert is a test exams every concert after the concert we uh, we, we can't think that we can take rest we we have to be ready for the next concert and we have to think about something new to produce on the concerts so uh, i am always try to i am uh, taking each concert as a examination i have not uh, answered so far that type of question <laughs> if it sounds odd we'll take it out don't worry just just say what you told me that is fine yeah yeah no Light is going on. Yeah. Come. 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 Come.
Uh, Srinivas, you started very young as an artist. Did you ever feel you could burn out early because of that reason? I don't think about my future, and uh, I, we don't uh, we don't know anything what will happen within one minute. I believe in God and I, I have faith in God. So let him decide what he has already decided. Okay, that's enough.
Thank you.